World Cup 2018, Gareth Southgate gave Jordan Henderson huge news at a risky time. Jordan Henderson was told by Gareth Southgate that he would not be England's captain for the World Cup four days before the biggest game of his life. It may not seem the best timing by the England manager but, typically, the Liverpool midfielder did not have a problem with it, wished Harry Kane all the best and then simply refocused on the Champions League final. And Henderson insists whether he has the armband or not, he will always be a leader for club and country. The manager rang me on the Tuesday in the week leading up to the final, said Henderson yesterday. I wasn't thinking about it, the captaincy, because of the final and that is where my focus was. When the gaffer told me I was really pleased for Harry and he is a fantastic player. It was normal for me, I just got on with it. Whether or not I'm captain doesn't matter, there are plenty of other leaders, Gareth is big on that and we don't want to put too much pressure on Harry. That is important for Harry and for the group. The manager has a good morale in the camp, he has a great togetherness and everyone is on board with what he is trying to do and to create leaders. He wants us to lead the group and take ownership and do it ourselves more. He has brought that to the camp and that will help certain players. It has a great feeling about it and hopefully we can show that in Russia. Henderson admits joining up with the England squad after a few days off with his family, has helped him overcome the devastation of Liverpool's defeat to Real Madrid and Kiev. He said, it was very tough, it was a difficult night, a difficult moment, but when you reflect, we have to look at the positives and how well we have done in the Champions League campaign. We flew back late, I was trying to relax the next day and sleep a little bit and then I went away on Monday, family time because I will not see them for a while. But football moves on quickly, we move forward and the World Cup means I can get ready for that. Henderson agrees with Skipper Kane's view that England must adopt the mentality that they can win the World Cup, even though he is scarred by the experiences of his three previous tournaments, the Euros in 2012 and 2016 which sandwiched the World Cup in Brazil four years ago. It's hard to say what is a success because of what has happened in the past he said. In the tournaments I've been to, we haven't achieved anything really, to be honest. Maybe the first Euros I played in when we beat Sweden in the group stages, got Italy, in the quarter-finals, and got knocked out on penalties but apart from that, we didn't get out of the group in the 2014 World Cup and got beat by Iceland in the last Euros. So other people will say what is a success in the World Cup? But as a player and as a group of players, why would you want to put a limit on what is success or not? You've got to go in with the mentality that we can go all the way because we are good enough as a team. And I think that is the right attitude to have. There have been a lot of upsets in sport, no disrespect but look at when Leicester won the Premier League, not a lot of the people at the start of the season would have said they could have done that. And that is just one instance, really. You have got to have belief in the group all the time and believe you can reach the heights. The strengths of this squad are the willingness and desire to succeed and improve every day. The attitude every day is high level, we have fantastic levels of fitness, the formation suits us, hopefully we can continue that. There are still a lot of things we need to improve on tactically. I would not like to chuck out anything specifically but there is a lot of work. For us the focus is on the team, not on individuals. We will be stronger together and we want to achieve something special. We have a great group of lads who want to be brave and give it everything they have got.